Hello and welcome to another brand new arc series stuff and things. Shh. Shush, me, hunty. Alright, so I was going to do another Atlas single player series, but I'm going to be honest. I just, I didn't, what are you doing? Stay still. Uh, I just, I, I, I just couldn't bring myself to do it. I just don't feel like playing Atlas. Dude, why, why are you just doing things? Anyway, I didn't, I really haven't felt like playing out. Can't, why are you interrupting? Rude. Um, yeah, I haven't felt like playing out this, so I figured I'd give Ark another go. It's been a while since I played it. So, here we are. We're in Ark. I'm playing on a multiplayer server. It's got, like, very small amount of basic mods and stuff. Um, so that's a good thing. It seems to be good. It seems to run smooth, so that's why we're doing it. I don't know what this series is going to be about. It's just going to be about me playing Ark. So, what we got to do now is we got to do our first steps in the world. Now, obviously, I've already taken a few. I have a, a, a Mozza Chops. He was wandering about in front of me, so he wanted a, Mejo, a Tinto Berry, so I gave it to him, and now we have him. Very simple. But we got to start off today's episode by finding our place to build our first home. But before we do that, we actually need to find a place to build. Um, to We need to build a place to get ready to do and my english just completely failed me i um, honestly my brain just straight up was like nope not gonna work uh so what we gotta do is we need to build a small little hut to, to get the basic thing stuff and things going we need to tame a pteranodon wherever the hell one of those are they're usually around here but can't see him. I've got a few ideas of where I want to build. I don't know if anyone's already built there. Like I said, this is a multiplayer server. I think I said that this was a multiplayer server. Um, what do you need? Fiverr? Um, so, I'm not 100% certain what areas are available to build. I know there's someone built over there near the Pirate Bay. But I've built at the Pirate Bay quite a lot. Oh, I've got lots of fiber on you. Can I take this? As my, I want this. This is mine. Thank you. And I'll take this as well. Thanks. Gotcha. Alright, uh, yeah, so someone's already built over there, but I don't want to build over there. I've built there before. Um, I don't want to build up on that hill right there above my head. Uh, I've built there quite a few times. There's a few places that I want to build. The, um, but we're like, uh, thinking down where that river is at the 40 line, maybe. There's a spot there. If not, down at like 30, 70, there was another spot that I remember, roughly. That's a guess. I can't remember the exact number where it is. It's probably more like 70, 20. I'm not sure. There's a few islands down in the bottom left and corner as well. Was it the bottom right? I don't know. There's a few places that I don't you dare move um, that I've got in mind. But yeah, anyway, let's get let's get into this. Let's just actually start building things. All right. We also have to get to like level 38, I believe, before we can even build... Um, uh, before we can even build, how many walls do we need? Six, seven. Before we can even build a saddle to fly the throne on. Let's have a look. Uh, P T E. Yeah, level thirty-eight. See, so we got a bit of leveling up to do. Thankfully, it shouldn't take too long. I think the, the leveling on this uh, server is pretty decent, so it shouldn't be too difficult. I'm just gonna quickly slap together a quick little hut here. Um, that's right, this isn't like Atlas, where they let you just keep building. Actually, is it? Do they fix it? <gasps> that is a thing. At least S Plus has it where I don't have to keep pressing the button. I can't remember, I can't tell you how annoying building in this game is where you get to press the button each and every single time. Um, but yeah, we don't have to worry about that now, which is great. Excellent. Right, can we just get this done? Great, we've got that basicness done. What else do we need? We need to increase. Let's increase our weight. Uh, weight, yeah, sure. Now, I'm not sure about the leveling. I think it's all. Uh, yeah, it's pretty much stock standard. 1.5 for movement speed. Health was 10. Stamina was 10. So yeah, that's good. Nothing too overpowered there. I don't. It gets a bit easy when you just overpower your leveling abilities. So that's good. That's good. Uh, what else do we gonna need? Clay. We don't need clay. Uh, sure, let's take a couple of these. I'll take one of these. Um, why the hell not, I suppose. If we're going to build, we might as well build properly. Alright, let's get... Can I escape? It's not going to close you. Okay, not annoying at all. 
<laughs> uh, okay, so we need what four of these bad boys. Boom. We need two of uh, these ones, and we need two of these ones. And then I think I've got to go out and do some leveling, because the leveling isn't as quick as I had imagined it. Now, eventually, I will come back and destroy this place, but not until I found out where I want to build my main base. Now, according to the server rules, you are allowed to have as many little outpost bases as you want, 2x2s, two I think they specifically said. But, I don't want to be the person that leaves a whole bunch of stuff um, lying around. <sighs> so kind of annoying. Uh, can I have you not be there? I don't miss the building system in this game, actually. Now that I think about it. <laughs> wait, wait. Like it's like the one pixel. There's like there we go. There's like one pixel where that would place. Excellent. All right, can we get the one pixel for this guy? Nope, we can't. Okay. All right. Can I have my pick up the SS wall back? Can I pick up the damn thing? No. Okay. <sighs> instantly remember why. Um, this was a pain in the butt to do in the olden days. Oh, we got a level up apparently, that's great. We're also building things we don't need, that's also great. Excellent, got it up! Alright, um... Six. We need one of you to finish off the build. There we go. Perfect! And we need a door. I forgot about the most important thing in life. Is a door. And that needs to be done. Oh, fortitude. I need to level up my fortitude as well. Boom. Okay, fortitude is increased. Thank God, fortitude is an important thing. Alright, so I don't really like the auto-open. I like the auto-close. There's our crappy little starter hut. <laughs> did I build... I thought I built a bunch of fireplaces. Or did I... Are you carrying my fireplaces? I built a fireplace. Not a whole bunch. But, you know, whatever. It is what it is. Alright, put you there. Put you here. You can have, like, half that wood and that meat. And light you on fire. Excellent. Okay, so, we need to level up. The best way to level up is to build storage containers. That's actually the best, that used to be the best way to level up. I'm not sure if it still is. Probably still is. Uh, we got thatch, we got fiber, we just need wood. Shh, shush. There we go. Let's go, let's build some storage containers. We actually do need some storage containers. Um, so it's not like this is a total waste. We should probably also build a bed. If we have the ability to do that yet. Yet. We don't. We gotta be like one more level. Okay, that's kind of annoying, but acceptable. I'm not curious, hold on. What do you take? Yeah, 25, 20, and 10. What did the foundations take? 6, 20, and 15. Okay. So, how much do you experience? 445 to 594. 595. So, 440. So like 50 odd. What? How much are you gonna give me? Let's have a look. 240, 747. So you give me a little bit more, and I can craft a lot more of you. Well, you guess what? We're gonna craft a whole bunch of these. I'm gonna put down these storage chests. Okay. Well, apparently I'm gonna put this storage chest down about here because I'm now over encumbered. And unlike Atlas, I can't move once I'm over encumbered. Can we actually place? One of these, like, here. Excellent. Oh, we can even place them on top of each other. Even better. Even better. How do we right-click? Excellent. All right, so I'm just going to stand here. Um, basically do nothing for the next couple of minutes. And once I finish building all of these foundations, we'll get on with the episode. But my, my mounty is gone. I don't know what happened to him. He disappeared. He's gone. He's vanished. He may have got killed. There was a level 168 Dilo one running around down here. Like about this area. So there's a chance he may have got killed. Um, I couldn't find any bag anywhere though. And I haven't been gone that long. So I'm, I, I don't know what happened to him. But that's fine. That just means that we have to tame another thing to gather up berries and luckily I'm starving um, and as well as the whole starving situation there is also a level 120 parasaur 
parasaur, yes. The, this guy, the guy that uses this saddle. Nope. Uh, this saddle? Yeah, this saddle that I picked out of a wide drop. With the ring around it. So, we're going to go tame that guy. But I haven't got to a level where I can use narco berries. So, I'm going to have to do something I haven't done since, like, oh God, probably the first time I ever played this game. And that is, we're going to have to use a club. <laughs> To knock this parasaur out. Now, I don't know how this is going to work. I haven't done this, like I said, in... Oh, I don't even know how many years it's been. I don't want to build that thing. Alright, but... You know what? This is like a back-to-basics back, back to basics type game, so... <laughs> let's do this thing. I apologise if the screen's a bit dark. It's night time. There's not much I can do about it. It's, I've set Gamma to 4. Well, hopefully that'll work. I'm not sure. I'm just trying to fill in the void while I run over to this thing. Okay, so you are the 120 female parasaur. Alright, we're going to do that. And then we're going to go here. We're going to ignore the compy. And we're just going to bash it. I don't know. I haven't got any knockout things. Please work. This is like, I, I feel so bad doing this. It's just wrong. Whacking it in the head repeatedly. I just... Just go to sleep for me. Just sleep. Just go to sleep. Sleep time. Oh, this is just. This feels so wrong. <laughs> oh, well. It is what it is. We gotta do what we gotta do. And my actual thing is about to break. Can I not have that? All right. Let's just. And I really don't want to miss the shot. Ugh! Gotcha. I didn't get you. What? I'm calling BS on that. I'm just going to put that out there now. Okay, now, while I'm not apparently allowed to move... Uh, let's just go here. Can I get close enough to build more bowlers? <sighs> Can I? No, I don't want to build that many. I'm not close enough. Uh, here. Need 30 stone. There. Yeah. Alright, where'd he go? Where'd she go? Uh, can I move? Oh, not being able to move thing is very annoying at times. Okay. <laughs> Where are you? This is going terribly for me, Paris. So you, you, you're embarrassed. Okay, listen. That was a bit BS. I'm uh, not going to lie. I am not happy with it. So... Oh, don't tell me the game. Oh, I got it at least. Server's being a bit weird, but, you know... You can't win when you play multiplayer. Alright, you need to go to sleep. Alright, just go to sleep. This is such an abusive way of team or something. No, I don't like this. Why aren't you a passive team? Why? Why do I have to stand here and belt you on the head so many times just to get you unconscious? Like, I'm going through this club like it's nothing. But to be fair, I haven't really done any leveling into melee. Which is probably part of the issue. I'm going to catch up with you. I am going to tame you. This is going to be an extremely violent process. And I apologise for that. This this dino, even though I'm going to tame it, it's never going to trust me. Never ever again. But, you know what? I can't really tame it. Being, being whacked in the head a hundred times. That's no good. That's no good for anyone. Just go to sleep. <laughs> Just sleep. Stop making me live through this horrible, horrible thing that I am doing. Uh, Alright, so I'm going to knock this guy out and I'll be back. Alright, it's been like 10 seconds. Just enough time for me to knock it out and kill these two compies. But yeah, here we go. This is our parasol. Uh, I don't have any measure berries. Why don't I have any measure berries? Because I left him inside the damn... Uh, I left him inside my mounty... Per thingy my blob and he's vanished and I don't have major berries. There we go. They're the things that I need. Luckily, um, it doesn't really matter if it takes me a minute to gather up all the things because oh, that's not the way taming works. There we go. Boom. Put that in your inventory. You're at 11%, 22%, 34% uh, because you were healing when I knocked you around a little bit earlier. That's perfect. So it won't take too long to get this guy back up. And once he's up and running, then I've got a berry collector again. Hopefully, I don't know, I'll probably come back and find something eating it. That's usually how this game works from memory. So, let's skip to where we've made some even more progress. Alrighty, well, after this many wooden foundations and 
thatched foundations and stuff and things. We are finally level 20, which means we can move on to the next upgrade for this house station life that we're doing. So the next thing we're going to do, well I want to do, is we need to make a smithy. Um, why? Because it's just the next stage. That's why. So we're going to need a forge to make some metal. We're going to need a smithy to make some things. And we might as well make these, even though we were giving, giving, given a set of metal tools when we first logged in. That's a plane flying over the top. Ready for the loud door close because it was hot in here and I had the door open. There we go. Anyway, <laughs> uh, what was it doing? Yeah, okay, so we need to build those. But first we need to build this refining forge, which I probably, if I'm to be honest, don't have the stone for. I don't, can I, can we have the S plus pool? There we go. Um, forge, where are you? There, pool, what are we missing? Flint, really? Nah, flint and stone. Okay, maybe not stone. Now we got stone there, okay. So just flint. Well, luckily, there's a rock right here. So we're just going to run up and whack this a few dozen times. Come on, we can do it. And, oh, I can't even get it. As I say, I'm a little bit OCD when it comes to making sure you... Um, finish off the nodes that you mine. All right, we've done that because I hate leaving half mo mo half mined nodes lying around. You're not gonna. There you go. Know what's going on? I think every now and then the server gets a little bit pausey. <laughs> All right, let's put that there. All right, now we're gonna chuck. You know what? You can have that much wood, and somewhere in one of these has ah metal. Excellent. You take this metal and light that on fire. It's going to take a second to cook up the five metal we need. Now, unfortunately, I don't think we're going to be able to make it to level 38 to go exploring yet today. But I figure what we could probably, 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 probably do. There we go. There's the wordly English I'm looking for. Is, um, I don't know why I'm mining this. Um, we could go and find at least a pteranodon worth taming, maybe. Or, at the very least, what we should do, I just thought of it, is maybe go get, um, I need that back here, uh, um, a spyglass. We need, we need crystal for a spyglass, because, you know, it makes it easy to find the things that you need. And I believe there was the awesome spyglass? Yeah, okay, so what do we need? Just two crystal? It's the only real, um, uh, special thing we need. Alright, well, crystal is pretty easy to get, I think. I think the closest or, or easiest node to get to will be in... There he is. You're not dead, you're alive! Where have you been? I've been worried sick about you. I thought you died. I thought like a high level thinking of Bob got you. Okay, you don't really do movement speed. Alright. Well, guess what? I should have done such stamina. God damn it, it's making me stupid. Well, guess what, buddy? Well, you're coming on an adventure with me because I need to get uh, some crystal. And the best place, the safest place to get crystal. Uh, probably there's some in that cave there's some at the top of that mountain about where that drop would be actually but um you know there's all kinds of bad stuff in those in those woods like therizinos and raptors and all other kinds of fun bitey things which I'm not really ready to deal with so I think we're going to go into this cave assuming we can someone else has already built here they've got a few pteranodons can I borrow one of your Tyranidons? There's a Stego running around. That's interesting. I wonder if that's a tamed or a wild one that's just trapped. Anyway, let's move on. So I'm pretty sure there's crystal in this one. Just cave. You don't poop. We got we got a mission. All right. Yeah, there's definitely crystal in this cave. I'm just trying to decide. Should we leave? Yeah, we're gonna. Oh, I'm sorry, uh, Mounty. We're gonna abandon you. If it's so slightly, do I have the stamina for this swim? Oh, that's gonna be. It's gonna be rough. Someone's definitely building. There's crystal right there. Is that crystal or is that just. No, that's just leaves. The crystal's much further down. I wish that was crystal. That would have made my life so much easier. 
I do think there is somewhere we can kind of stand on a rock when we get over here though. Um, hopefully there is because stamina, uh, stamina seems to be going down slow enough. It's not too much of an issue, but we have got to get back as well. So, yeah. So yeah, there's these little ledges on here. We have got somebody. Somebody is building in here. Don't know what they're up to, but they are building apparently. Or well, they were. I don't know. I feel like that's a big platform thing that they're building. We're gonna leave them alone. I don't really want to snoop on anyone just yet. I just want to go get my crystal. Which is right there. See, I knew there was crystal in here. Do I have much stamina left? I don't know because I just <laughs> I just did the smart thing of charging towards this area. Now maybe when I mine this these crystal I'll get some rare mushrooms. Oh well, that's not really important actually. I was gonna say because there's another mozzer chops there was another mozzer chops around the base and I could tame it and it wanted rare mushrooms but it's not really worth the time now I suppose I guess um yeah because we we found out mozzer chops he didn't he didn't die he's fine he's alive he was just chilling out with someone else's you didn't give me any crystal there you go that was rude I can't believe you didn't give me any crystal you haven't even given me any mushrooms anyway to Making my whole tamer mozzer chops, but don't really need a tamer mozzer chops things null and void. Didn't give me any. Alright, well there we go. Some nice easy crystal, nice and safe. Now back to the base. Um I should be able to make it back. Stamina. Yeah, I'll be fine. I am worried about drowning. I hate drowning. <laughs> Why did I go straight into water then? That made no sense. That was weird. Alrighty, we're back! We got both our teams here now. That I thought Mountie was gone, but Mountie isn't gone. Yay! Um, so I think what we should do is we should probably let's build our smithy now. We should have enough metal. We do. Excellent. I like that. Now we're gonna just kind of put this here, I guess. Perfect. So we can work on our bench and have a look outside and see Grass Hill. I mean, we could do it on this side and look out and see ocean, but no, 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 no. I want to see grass hill. <laughs> Alright, now that we've done that, let's also make this thing. Okay, we'll grab that. And can I just dump all of that in there? Somebody gave me a bunch of berries and things, which is kind of cool of them. So we'll just chuck that in there. We'll turn all of those berries into narcotics because narcotics come in handy. You can hold all of these berries for me too. I'm going to right click and go split all like that. Perfect. I love it when everything just kind of comes together. Now where is my spyglass? Excellent. Alright, let's have a look. Where are some good pteranodons? Now there was one flying around over here before. Don't know where. Uh, let's just go like this. Have a look at you, Mozzer Chops, level 66, alright? I think that's the one that required um, mushrooms, which doesn't matter because one, we found our Mozzer Chops, and two, I didn't get any mushrooms anyway. Too tame. <laughs> Too tame, a guy. So that's a little bit of a bummer. But we can go over here. There's always Pteranodons running about around this area. Usually there is. It's going to make up. There's one. What level are you? Level 24. You're disgusting. Your existence offends me. All right, let's move on. What do we got here? 156 Tyrannotops, uh, Triceratops. Oh, little thieving monkeys. I don't like these guys. Go away. No, I ran out of stamina. Of course I'm out of stamina. Where are all the Tyrannodons? There's one. Level 66. There's a Therizino up there. All the, all the Triceratops that I've seen are, tend to be high level at the moment. I think that's probably just a fluke, but it is what it is. Oh, you, you're level 66, but you're up in the evil area. You're especially up in the evil area. Okay, we go with Dilo. You're 24. Your your existence is offensive. Your existence is offensive. That's the wording England I'm trying to say. <sighs> it's one of those days with me. There's no decent pteranodons anywhere that we can spy out. Like, I don't need it to be, like, over ridiculous levels. I'm guessing these are people that haven't played for a while. Um, but, you know... It'd be nice if there was just something decent. 
to something decent. I guess we might have to go try our luck with that level 66 guy. Uh, level 24. Hmm. Yeah. Looks like that level 66 guy is going to be our... Can I get rid of the chat? Yeah, it's going to be our main guy. Who are you? You are swag. Okay. Well, there was two of you. Um, enjoy? <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, so what we got to do is we got to go and make up some train carriers. Now, unfortunately, I am kind of a... Is that another person sleeping? I am um, a little bit of a low level. I need to be level 21 for train carriers, but that shouldn't be too hard to get to. Just got to make a few more floors that are never going to be used. What level are you? You're the 24 offensive one? I mean, I should get rid of you if I want to get better level 1s to spawn, but I don't really have the uh, equipment required for that as of yet. What the hell was running about? Alright, so I'm going to make up a bunch of Trank Arrows, then we're going to come back and we're going to team probably that level 66 guy up there, unless I find another higher level 1. We, m oh, Yeah, I might try just on the other side, over that way, just on the other side of this blue obelisk. Sometimes they spawn over there, so I thought I got rid of the chat. The chat needs to go away. I don't like the chat. Oh well, it is what it is. Okay, so I'll be back once I found our guy. Your, your existence is offensive as well. Anything under level mm, 60 is offensive. I don't know. This is a random stay. Alright, it's starting to get dark, but... I have managed to get to level 21, and I did see a level 120 um, pteranodon over there. So hopefully we can get all of this done. Um, I need you. Alright, so you need to make a bow. Yes. Give me this. Bam. We need probably like a couple of bowlers. Bam. We're going to need arrows. Let's make 30 of them. Bam. Okay, we can make 22 of them. That'll do. Let's take, like, you don't need all of these. Just that many would do. Excellent. Uh, then we can just make that many tank arrows. And then we can equip our bow. And put tranks on it. Now let's go find this. Oh, I need meat. I only have basic meat, but it's only a low level team anyway. So that should be plenty. I did find a tech parasaur and I destroyed it and that let me get some element dust and some electronics. Element dust is... Eh. <laughs> I mean, you need a thousand for one piece of element, so it's not exactly the most useful thing. Unless you're on... Um... Oh god, what, what was it? What was the one with the city in it? I can't remember the damn names. Extinction? Was it Extinction? I can't remember the names of the maps. But yeah, because uh, on that other map you can get like uh, nodes, uh, you can farm element dust from everything and you get like nodes and stuff. Hello big odd whatever this thing is, I don't know. Where was that Pteranodon that I saw? Is that you please? Nope, that's level 66 so that can be used as a yeah, backup. Please don't be over the water. Every time I try to tame one of these things they always end up over the water. I need stamina. I should probably start putting levels into stamina. Uh, that's a Megalodon. That's a disgusting Megalodon. It's a Lystro. It's getting dark. On the plus side, it's easier to see things. Is that you? No, you're level 24. You are offensive. Um, Gamma. <laughs> There's another person passing out over there. Um, where is it? It's not you, is it? Oh, there you are. That is you. What are you, by the way? 114, what do you want? Just out of curiosity. Prime mate, don't have that. 66, alright, let's go after this 120. Which is up there, I believe, at the moment. I need you to come down. I need you, I need you to come down. Alright, I'm going to use this person's bridge. Thank you. Beach bombs. I don't know what that first word What? Imminence? I don't think that's spelled right. Is that spelled right? I don't know. It doesn't really matter. Um, okay, so you're going to be up there. So I want to run around up here and watch it go down the bottom part. Because that's just the way... Alright, now the trick is to not look at it. If you look at it, it never lands. 
But if you just keep it off to the side, it will eventually land in probably the most dangerous place of all time. That's 120. Oh my god, don't tell me that was the one that I was looking for. Wait, was there anyone right above me? Yeah. Okay, you're 120. Is it 120? Is this the 120? Okay, I'm not looking at you. It's fine, I'm doing other things. Don't mind me. Totally safe for you to land. Oh no, okay, look, look at the pretty thing. Charge! Get it! Get it! Ugh. I missed. Oh. Okay, well this is, this is... Perfect timing for a server issue. I got it though. Okay. Yeah, we need to hurry up because I don't know how long we have to the thingy breaks. So we're just gonna. There we go. Perfect. You go there. You take my meat and you eat this for me. And that's gonna be it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. We didn't. Yeah, we got a bit accomplished, but unfortunately we can't quite get to um, a, a flying stage yet because it's level 38 for some reason. They've decided to make it that you need to be able to fly a Pteranodon. And this is quite a large map, and running around on foot would not be ideal. I mean, it takes quite a long time to get anywhere on this map by foot. Uh, and I don't want to do that. I don't even know where... Where or what is available? There's another tech thing here. I want to go get you. You know what I should have done? It's level 187 techie. Hmm. Can I knock it out and tame it? Probably not. I don't know. But it's a tech one. I can get free electronics from it. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> But yeah, anyway, I, I forgot what I was saying. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope you did enjoy it. Next episode, hopefully we'll be able to... I'm going to try power level between now and next episode. So we're at least level 38. And we can go and uh, find a place to live. Find a place to set up. Don't know what's available. We'll figure it out. And until then, guys, as always, have a good one. And I'll see you all next time. Bye. Say bye. She just wants to sleep. Lazy.